All right, last one for you, uh, Trent. When Nick Foles was acquired by the Bears and put in the same quarterback room as Mitchell Trubisky, um, I, I, I wonder what you think, to what this means to – all we're hearing is the phrase, this is going to push Mitch. Doesn't this basically lift the kimono up about how uh, Trubisky isn't the number two overall quarterback savior that the Bears hoped? Uh, I give you the floor on what you thought when you heard about the Foles to Bears trade. Well, one, I like the trade. I think the Bears had to do something. Um, you can – you can say we love Mitch Trubisky and in the same breath say, but he needs to be pushed more. He needs competition. He needs, um, there needs to be an edgier room. You know what I mean? He need, every day needs to matter more, so to speak. Uh, and you have a backup plan in Nick Foles, who's proven to be kind of that perfect guy, right? The perfect guy that can come in in a backup situation and help you win football games, especially if you're as good as the Bears, I think should be. Um, kind of like his Eagles experience. Uh, really good team. Uh, you, you don't have to do a ton. Um, you're, I, the term manage the game obviously comes back to me, which I don't take as a, you know, as a knock. You do. You are managing situations. Um, you're not the reason the team's going to win, but you're never going to be the reason the team loses. Um, I think Nick Foles is the perfect guy for that, and he's a great guy. You know, I think that's the other thing that people – miss in this quarterback room dynamic is and I always go back to my relationship with Matt, Matthew Hasselback is he's a great human being like he's as good a human being as you're ever going to meet so when you're going through hard times in a room at least you're going through it with somebody that is a lifelong friend and I think Matthew and I had that relationship that brought the best out of both of us I think you have the same dynamic that can happen in Chicago is just Nick Foles' presence in that quarterback room uh, is going to help Mitch as he goes through rocky times, even if that means Nick is the one playing at the time. And I know people can't wrap their brain around that, right? Oh, no, it's life or death. No, it's, it's really making sure that room is as strong as it can be. The stronger that room is, the better product on Sunday uh, the quarterback playing will be.